Hello. Welcome to X Tour live stream. This is Jason. This is Susan. Hello. Welcome all. Yeah. So today's topic is X Tour M1. Yeah. Uh, we are uh, actually before we launch a lot of new accessories for X Tour D1, but for X Tour M1 users, uh, they don't get any uh, accessories mm -hmm. before. But today, yeah, finally we bring two. New. Actually, it's three two accessories for X Tour M1. Yeah, that is the M1 Air Assist set and M1 riser base with honeycomb panel. These days we stayed in the laboratory and tested five a thousand times. Finally, today here we are super satisfying to bring you these two new machines, new accessories. For the Air Assist set, you can get the link in the comment. You can save around thirty dollars now. And for the riser base with the honeycomb panel, you can save up to ninety dollars now. If you buy two together, you save in total one hundred forty-eight dollars. That's a lot. Yeah, yeah. So uh, yeah, we uh, we have two things, two box today. So this one is extra uh, air assist. This is a very useful. Uh, uh, accessories for X2 M1 is the uh, design for uh, for cut uh, effect very good. So it's uh, um, it will it will make your your cut on wood very clean and uh, uh, very uh, clear. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and uh, another one is the X2 the the riser base, base together with the honeycomb. honeycomb. Yeah, so it's uh, uh, it's a riser. Actually, actually, M X2 M1 have a riser, but it's a very simple riser. But today we have a new riser, in, so it can ra raise the machine and in the same time to keep the to keep the uh, enclosure to keep it close, mm -hmm. keep the machine close and uh, and other functions. Okay, so uh, first let's unboxing. Yeah. Yeah. Team, please close up. Okay, so here is the box of. Uh, the air assist. That. The air assist. So here you can. We have a pump. Actually, it's the is a uh, pump similar with the D1. Mm -hmm. It's a normal pump. Here we have some small accessories for X4 M1. So because uh, on the design, it's not very easy for M1 to add an air assist because it's not like D1. It's open, but for M1, it's enclosed. Uh, it's is a it have a. Uh, enclosure. So uh, actually, it's uh, a little hard to uh, design the uh, accessories uh, enclosure. Uh, yeah, we offer you for that. two lamp mounts. There are two lamp mounts. So in order to use this, you need to replace the original lens mouse, uh, lens mouse, and uh, uh, use this one. This one in, inside this one, you can see there is a magnet. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we. Oh. Magnetic. Yeah, and uh, here we can see uh, we have uh, two of these. We have two of two. these, and uh, also we have uh, another here. We have another here. It's designed for M1, and uh, it uh, it works like this. So uh, okay, two magnet together, and it's easy to take it out. But if if it's not mounted, it's a, it's a little hard. And we have two of these. Actually, we have two two of these. Uh, one is on, on the machine later. So this is um, uh, the main part. Other things like like so this uh, plastics. This plastic is for a uh, tube organizer to make your tube clean. Yeah, we have two tube clamps. And uh, some other accessories. A tweezer, a, a tool tweezer. to help you like pick or keep yeah. the items. Actually, this is for uh, assemble for assemble this uh, reassemble the lamp mouse. Lamp mouse. We will show you how to install it later. Okay. Yeah. And so what about let's check the riser base and the honeycomb. Wow, first coming as a honeycomb panel. It's a honeycomb. And uh, we have some small design here. You can see uh, uh, this is uh, the- Material the, pins. Yeah, material pins for you to uh, make to make the- To um, fix. Fix the material and make it flat. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You see the magnet here, very strong magnet. So the, the force actually is, uh, is uh, strong. 
As you use it, be careful because the honeycomb hold is a little bit sharp. Yeah, and uh, so here is the riser. Riser base. Yeah, riser base. We have two of these. It's made of metal, all metal. And uh, we have two of these and the two acrylic to use the riser. The same time to make your uh, in, make make the enclosure closed. Yeah, another play to. We have a left one and a right one. Yes. They come together to hold out the whole end one. So let's see how we how are gonna. To, yeah, use these together. accessories. Okay, yeah. we take the box out. Okay. Wow. Well, it's then. not heavy. <laughs> <laughs> Easy to carry. So Jason is going to show you how to install. Uh, so first, in order to um, install the node, the air assist set, first thing is to take out the bottom plate. OK. Take out the bottom plate. From Maybe, the bottom, from the bottom. Yeah. Take it away. Okay. Close the lid. And, and uh, we are going to turn it over. Out. Yeah, it needs some. It's not like M, uh, X2 or D1. It's very easy to uh, mount the accessories. But for M1, you need some, uh, some work to do. But it's not that hard. So here, yeah, we see these things. What, what's this for? What's tweezer. this for? The tweezer. <laughs> tweezer is for... <laughs> For okay. changing the yeah. lens. Changing the lens mount. There are two small holes here. So we use the tracer to lose this lens mount. And we uh, use the new one here. Mm -hmm. So it's, uh, it's not hard to mount this. And uh, make sure, make sure the, it's uh, parallelized Parallel. with the machine, like this way. Yeah. OK, this way. Perfect. Yeah. So um, OK, then. Then is the setting of the ESC set. Now Jason so. is carrying. A tube. Yeah, so this is the this is the uh, nozzle here. It's very easy for you to mount the nozzle on the on the tube and put the put the nozzle this this way. Yeah, it's very easy, and it's also very easy to uh, take it out. Yeah, be careful. Be careful not to. Uh, Okay, and if you have you have blade here, you you, you should not use it together with the blade. Uh, it's better to take the blade out, because uh, it may uh, it may uh, hurt your hands sometimes if you are not very careful. So so when you uh, do this, uh, please be careful not uh, not touch the blade. Okay, so uh, then we uh, flip it over. Yeah. Flip it over. Okay, I need to go this side. Yeah, actually the whole process doesn't take too long. You can do it on your own within two or three minutes. So if you are interested in it, please check the link in the comment. You can check out the two-in-one kit for an air set and the riser base with honeycomb panel. If yeah. you buy two together, you can save $148. That's a lot. I have to say that it's only for life, only for those who are always staying by our side waiting for M1. So please keep the chance. Yeah, so this is how to use the uh, tube organizer. Here you can uh, uh, paste it yeah. on the 
uh, structure. You can see there is a label okay. here. The label is help. The label tells you where the tubes should be placed. Yes, that that is a hole. That is a hole for you if you are not to get use it together with the razor. There's a hole on the bottom plate, so for you to to make to take the tube outside of the machine because the, we need to put the uh, pump outside of the machine. And uh, yes, that's that's the way how to how to uh, install the air assist. And uh, so we can put the bottom plate back. We can put the bottom plate back. I just assembled the like the basic structure of the riser base. So that's it. We can put the whole M1 on it. Yeah, with so put the acrylic on it. I think it's this way. Yeah, so uh, here you can see, uh, let's see the, the tube, how the tube will go outside of the, the machine. And here you can see on the, on the bottom plate, there is a space for the tube. So every bottom plate originally have, the, have this hole. So you, you don't need to worry about the, the tube, how to go outside of the machine. Okay, so um, then we put the machine on the razor. I think we need to make it uh, in the middle of the table. Okay. So that's, it's very easy to use the razor. Yeah, so that's on the, all done. yeah, it's uh, all done. We plug the into the nozzle. Okay. So if we want to use the uh, uh, together with the razor, we we have on the razor we have a hole. We have a hole for the tube. So um, actually, we uh, we make some small change on the tube. Today, all of the engineers are sitting here, so if you have any questions, please feel free to leave them in the comment bar. Also, the product marketing manager, Joy, is here. You know who, Joy. Yeah, so um, that's, we, we finished the installation mm -hmm. of the air assist and the razor. Yeah, that's, that's all the things that uh, it uh, look like. Yeah, so after the assembling, right now we can do some tasks. Yeah, we do some projects to showcase. So what benefit uh, air assist can bring? So we said that it can uh, uh, make your cutting very clean. So let's try it. Yeah. So using the ASC set and the riser base with honeycomb is a win-win solution. So because the ASC set outputs strong airflow and for the honeycomb, for the riser base, 
it helps you like um, pass through all the air out. So as they come together, you can get a cleaner result. Okay. Let's have a try. Uh, we use honeycomb to cut. We take out the bottom plate. Okay. So. It's very easy for you to take out the honeycomb here. Now we are going to test the cutting of a three millimeter pine wood with, as I said, when without it. So you can make a clear comparison between the efforts. Yeah, I made a small mistake here, I think. About the SSZ link, you can get it in the comment. Also, the riser base with honeycomb. Buy two together, you can save $148. Besides, we offer so many surprises for you. So we have three well -well lucky draw today. For the first round, we'd like to draw a free easy set. And for a second, we provide you something precious and special. That is a Primarian x Mooncake. And for the last one, please stay tuned because the last one, the last guy can get a free easy set and a riser base with honeycomb. Okay. I, I will install the honeycomb here so just put the honeycomb on the in the machine the fit very well you can see the fit very well we uh, we use a laser to cut a three millimeter base wood here and the tube actually the tube seems it's okay if you uh, close the um, sink and uh, you can uh, use the, how do you say this? Pin. pin. Material pin. It's used like this way. Yeah, if you cut some uh, uh, easy to move materials, like a paper, and also you can use it this way. Yeah, because it, uh, have a, it's a strong magnet. I love the clicking sound. Okay. Since yeah, we, we didn't, the, since we don't use the plane, so we I, keep I, it I, at I, the bottom. You can keep the bottom plate on the bottom of the razor, yeah, to protect your desk. Okay. So we put back the acrylic. And then we start to cut. So we will cut a leaf. Yeah, I put I already put the materials in. So here we uh, we cut a from here. Maple leaf. leaf. Maple leaf. Okay, maple leaf here. Yeah. So uh, I can uh, auto measure the materials thickness. Yep, M1 has a smart camera inside. It yeah, auto it's scans what inside. Okay. And you can use it to auto measure. And then we cut, I think the parameter is all set. Yeah, here we the power is 100%. And the speed is 3 minutes per second. Yeah, All the parameters are Refer, are referred by M1. Okay. So during the during the cut, I will close and uh, open the uh, air assist. Let's see the cutting edge different. Now it's working. Yeah. So in the first half, I will I open the air assist. And uh, later, I will close the air assist, close the pump to see the difference to with or without uh, air assist. As it is processing, the air assist set blows away all the debris and smokes. You can hear the noise. Now it is blowing away the smoke. Yeah, the pump actually is very silent. 
so the debris won't pile up on the surface, then you can get a cleaner result. Okay, and uh, on the other half, uh, I close I close the pump. Let's see uh, when when it finished. Let's see the difference. How uh, the cutting edge different? Yeah. Okay, wait a minute. So after we finish this project, we have the first uh, lucky jewel. The first lucky jewel today is... That uh, is a free acid set. Uh, how, how many we have? We have one for the first round. Okay. And then we have uh, other round. We have uh, mooncakes today. And uh, we also have uh, uh, other rounds, uh, the yeah. third round. At the last round, we would like to draw a free acid set with a rice base and a honeycomb. So please stay tuned and feel free to share the link to all your friends who are interested in cutting and engraving. Okay. How many, how many, how, how many acids in the first round we have? Only one? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, team, please close up. By the way, we also made so many projects with the ASS. You can see here is an earring stand. We made it like a tree on purpose. Made me feel very lively. So there are so many wood earrings on it. They are also cut by M1 with the assist. You can do the same one also. It's too slow. And now four is coming. Besides the wood maple leaf we are doing, we also made a pair of acrylic maple leaves. So I guess you can make so many items like the pumpkins, maple leaves, or anything you like to welcome the whole floor to decorate your home or your car. And as weekend is coming, actually you can have a driver tour to the Big Bear Lake or the Jenny Farm, the Jenny Place of Forest Gum, where you can view have a good view of okay. the four we foliage we finished wait a moment we finished okay here uh, we can see the difference that uh, with or without the air assist i think you can see easily from uh, from the camera yeah here you can see here is with the air assist so the cutting edge is very uh, clean and the line is very uh, sharp. But without, uh, without air assist, it's, uh, the cutting line actually is, uh, I think it's uh, not that clean and, uh, and it's not uh, uh, sharp. So we can see the difference here. It's easily to see, see the difference. You can see, if I put it back. Yeah, so with the air assist, you will, you will get a very clean cutting surface. edge. Yeah, and a very clean surface here. You can, the, the surface of the wood actually is very uh, uh, clean. Yeah, so uh, it's very easy to understand the benefit of the uh, cutting uh, yeah. ability on the, on the machine and also I see right now you are very long for the lucky draw so the keyword is air assist air assist just type once and we are gonna draw a free one for you catch the time Okay, so I can, I can draw one right now. Three, two, one, go. So congratulations, Yvonne Tang. You just won a free air assist set. Congratulations, Yvonne Tang. 
Please contact Facebook X2O in 48 hours. Yeah. So that's the, uh, the first lucky draw. And uh, then we do another project. Yeah, we test uh, the cutting ability of M1. I think we didn't show that before. So mm -hmm. on my hand is the uh, wood. Thanks. So the thickness, the thickness of the wood is uh, nine, nine, 10 millimeter, 9.9, 9, 10 millimeter uh, thickness of wood. So what kind of wood is? Pine wood. Pine wood. Yeah. Okay. So let's see uh, if we can cut through this wood. So this is the machine we are using is uh, X2 M1 10 watt. Yeah, we are making a challenge. We haven't shown this before, so you can see how well the air set working. Yeah. So the air assist is very useful when you want to cut uh, 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 thick material because in this case you need to make the speed of the laser very slow. So we, we will use the parameter of uh, so 100% power and in the same time the speed is 2 millimeters per second. Actually, we spent a lot more time. Uh, spent. So here we, we cut the, the map leaf uh, I think it's a three millimeter per second. It's uh, too low, but we can we can make it uh, faster. But for the uh, for the thick wood, we use the parameter two millimeter per second, and we cut a line on the material just uh, to test if this machine can cut through. Auto measure. So we auto measure the. Uh, thickness and uh, if you want to cut very slow uh, very thick material it's better to make the focus to make the focus point on the middle of the uh, nearly on the middle of the material like for example here we test that the uh, the, the surface of the uh, of the material is 7.2, but we need to make the focus point on the middle of the material. Uh, so that means we need, we, I, I will change this, uh, this number to 11. Okay, that's it. Let's see the cutting. We cut a line, one line it will be very fast. Now we are using the acid to cut the 10 millimeter pine wood. Now the pump is working. It outputs strong air flow, so it helps the cutting deeper. Besides, okay, we okay. have done a project before that is a very delicate and awesome pattern of the maple. You can do it also. So keep the chance to get the asset. It is enjoying $30 off only on life. And the project is done. We can move back to see. Yeah, we can see if it's uh, cut through. I will take the material. It's not that true. Okay, because uh, I think so. The max cutting ability of the of the uh, ten watt actually I think is nine. It so we can see there's a little space that we cannot cut through, and that depends on the material. Yeah. So on this material, it's the you can see here is we cannot cut through here. But we see the, the cutting edge actually is uh, uh, it's very clean. Oh, I see. It's that. very smooth. I didn't I didn't open the air assist. I forgot to open the air assist. But we I think we we can so that's without uh, air assist. It's um, uh, very hard to cut through. Let's try 
if with the L assist, we can uh, cut through it or not. Yeah, let's make a comparison. So without the air assist, the max cutting ability of the pine wood is about 10. I think it's about eight or nine mm -hmm. millimeter. But it depends on the material. If the material is uh, have some uh, have more water to include, I'd say it will not that good. Okay. So here we test the result. So with the air assist on. Still the same parameter. Yeah, same parameter. Let's try it. Okay. I'm trying to convince the wife to let me buy a law. Yeah, just do it. You can all enjoy the live only sale right here. When does the discount expire? After the live, so right now, just catch the time. You can save $148 off for the air set and the rest of base with honeycomb panel. About the power of M1 with the air set. It can cut through yellow acrylic in three times. This is a three millimeter acrylic plate. Okay. So let's see if with an air assist we can uh, cut the thick wood cut through or not. So here we can see the cutting edge actually is very clean. I just still not cut through. I think it's the uh, it's still not a, not cut through. It's also left. I think that's uh, one less than one millimeter for the the thickness. So uh, yeah, we cannot. So with the with X two M one, actually it's very hard to uh, cut through. The machine uh, cut through the thick wood with uh, uh, 10 millimeter, but if for 8 millimeter, I think for 8 millimeter, millimeter and uh, 9 millimeter, I think it's, it will cut through it. And that depends on your wood. If your wood is very dry wood, I think it's very easy. But it's a wet. If it's a wet wood, it's hard to engrave, uh, hard to cut through. Yeah, we can it really. All so we didn't testify so many times. We just want to show you the okay. most, the realist situation. But I guess if you like change the focus, use the driver wood, something, try it a few times, I think maybe you can try to cut a thicker pine wood successfully. Then yeah, so we, uh, we showed uh, another project that we used the uh, Razor, how to use the razor together with RA2 Pro. Actually, it's, a, it's a very convenient because you have a very good, uh, a lot more space on the, uh, on the height. Okay, so uh, here we put the, so we have a different layers for you to put your uh, honeycomb. honeycomb. I think I will take it out. You can put it to different layers, and you can also put it here, so different layers. So here, we, because the diameter of the cup is a little big, we put it in the bottom layer. Okay, so uh, this, this will help you to make the uh, fit different uh, thickness of the materials or different uh, right. diameter of the cylinder. So here, actually, we have a very small design. We have a tape inside the RA2 Pro for you to measure the diameter of the 
of the oh, tumbler. The cel cylinder here, and uh, there's another small design here. So you can see it's a, it's a not a normal, it's not a normal tape. Actually, we, we can see here we have beta, we have gamma, we have alpha. alpha. So what this means? So uh, you can see if the, if you measure here the line on the gamma, we can see here the gamma here. Okay, this, this will uh, uh, show, uh, help you to find the right layer for you to put the honeycomb. Okay, so here we have gamma and uh, here you can see we have alpha, beta, gamma here on the, uh, on the razor. So if you, uh, if you measure the diameter of the uh, cylinder, it's, uh, uh, it's on the gamma, you, you will you put the honeycomb on the, on the bottom layer. And if it's uh, smaller, for example, if it's, uh, it's on, the, on the yellow here, beta, if it's a very small cylinder, uh, it's a beta here, and you put it on the another layer of the honeycomb. But if you want, you don't want to use the use this tape. You just want to. You just need to keep the. So make sure that you put the uh, cylinder in the machine, and make the upper surface the the upper surface of the uh, of the cylinder be higher higher than the bottom plate. Okay, here we uh, we put the saline rotary uh, RA2 Pro. We are using the RA2 Pro, and uh, I need a cable. So here uh, we put the heap cable on it. Yeah, make sure the RA2 Pro is parallel to the fore edge of M1. For the i2 Pro, you can get it from the comment. Hi, the i2 Pro link, please. Okay. Continue. I guess the preparation is all done. One thing you need to do is to make the, there is a rat red dot laser, very weak laser, you need to make the um, make, spot. make this spot on the top of the car. Okay, finish setting. Close and uh, put back the acrylic. Okay, I think uh, uh, my colleague helped help me to. So, do we finish the auto measurement? Auto measure. Just skip it. For cylindrical engraving. Okay. Uh, I think the, the measure is okay. Okay, here everything we finish is set. Yeah, we are gonna engrave some maple patterns on it. It's the high time to go camping, to go hiking, to have a good view of the fall foliage. Okay, I think it will be very quickly to finish. Mm -hmm. And at the same time, we Chinese people also celebrate the four. We have a special date that is the May Autumn Festival. So we are gonna have some culture bridge to show you this. Now Jason yeah, is gonna yeah. tell you. During the uh, project, uh, we are, uh, because several days later, it will be Chinese uh, uh, 
Mid-Autumn Moon Festival. Actually, this is one of the most important festivals in China. Yeah, so we, uh, we love this festival very much because we have very good food uh, at that day. And uh, so the date, so the date of, the, uh, of this festival actually is on 18th August mm -hmm. in Chinese Lula Canada. It's not in it's not a, in Western Canada. It's in Chinese Lunar Canada. Yeah. Yeah. So several days later, it will be 18th uh, August, and uh, at that day, the moon will be the roundest, the fullest, and, uh, bright, brightly, brightest. The brightest. Yeah. Chinese people actually like round because uh, in China, in China, mo many tables actually are round. Round. Yeah. People sit round the table. So round means. Gathering, yeah, yeah reunion. reunion, yeah. So, uh, so uh, in the family, every people come at home and a reunion, and yeah. at that day we eat mooncakes. Yeah. So we would like to draw five prime men next to your mooncakes later. Please stay tuned. Yeah. So here is the is the uh, mooncake. Close up, please. Is a, is a moon cakes that uh, actually we, we have lucky draw today. We have yeah. five of five of uh, box of uh, moon cakes for you to. Uh, we we want to share the Chinese this Chinese food here. Uh, it's a very um, small moon cakes. So today uh, I will take out the what it look out look like. Yeah, it's. Uh, Look like this. Yeah. And uh, so inside the, the mooncake, there are different. Okay, we cut the mooncake. We made a beautiful ceramic plane. Yeah. So inside the. <laughs> it's lava custard. It ha Whoa! Oh my God! I want to taste it right now. <laughs> okay, so that's that's kind of a Chinese mooncake. So outside, uh, so inside the, the mooncake, there are different. There are say? different materials inside. Yeah, yeah. Actually, it's so different from meat, from uh, beans, and uh, and um, yeah, people will put uh, many kind of things inside the inside the mooncakes and eggs. Yeah. So uh, so here. Uh, so it's, uh, this festival is similar like um, Western Thanksgiving, I think. Yeah, because uh, for uh, for these uh, holidays, it means gathering, means Thanksgiving, means praying, and uh, it's similar like um, uh, Thanksgiving. It's similar like uh, family reunions, and the difference is on the on the food. Yeah, we are we are eating this kind of mooncakes. And actually, uh, mooncakes are so different because uh, we have not only on the on the inner side of the mooncakes, but also on the on the outer side we have this kind this size of mooncakes. We also have very big mooncakes. Yeah. So the second uh, round, round of, of lucky, lucky draw, draw is, is by premium mooncakes. Yeah, is the mooncakes. So please type mooncake. Please time moon cake and we'd like to draw five lucky guys. So you start right now? Uh, not yet, they are typing right now. So a <laughs> team please close up. Uh, we also make so many like tools. We engrave a knife and a fork. You can also decorate all of these items with M1. Yeah. yeah. You can do it also. So okay. So check let's check. Maybe so let's check the project first. Let's check the project first, and then we will start the lucky draw of a moon cake very quickly. Okay, here, here we see the engraving. Actually, it's a, it's very accurate. So every each uh, map leaf is closed. You see. Uh, You can see here. Check it out. The cutting result is perfect. So many maple leaves. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, and uh, it's uh, 360 uh, engraving. Yeah, it uh, works very good with, together with the RA2 Pro. So if you have RA2 Pro uh, in your hand, we, we know that a lot, a lot of uh, customers, you buy RA2 Pro together with X2 M1. And uh, with the razor that we released today, it, I think it's a very good fit. Yeah. Now okay, we can so lucky have draw. the lucky draw. Lucky draw. Lucky draw for the mooncakes. We have, free, we have five uh, mooncakes. Moon yeah, we hope that you like the Chinese traditional food. And we, we hope to share the happiness with you. Okay, you, okay. Uh, you three, start. two, one, go. Yeah, so okay. here the mooncake. Congratulations, Tony Mario. Congratulations, Tony Mario. And Jesse Counter, Brent Clingforth, Paul Lam, and David Hart. Yeah, congratulations. You five just won Prime Win S2 Mooncakes. Yeah, it's X2 special mooncakes because on the box, on the box is uh, we have X2, we have uh, uh, Happy Moon Festival. So in Chinese, with the Zhong Qiu Kuai Le. I hope you like it. Yeah. So that's done. So please don't type Moon K right now. Uh, just now we made a very beautiful Tumblr for Tumblr. You can get it for a link. And also, if if you are new coming, you can have the M1 Deluxe bundle with the AI Assist set with the riser base and honeycomb all of this coming together save you 200 free and 30 dollars now okay so uh we so one thing that we need to mention is the shipping time uh-huh uh so about the shipping time okay for the is that we will ship it out in one to three business days Okay, so for the air assist, we already finished the manufacturing. It's all the, all the sets actually in our stock. So we will ship through the air. So if you buy today, I think you will, uh, you will receive it several days later. You won't need to make too much long. And uh, if you buy it today, I think the, uh, you got the discount of 30 US dollars off for the air assist. Mm -hmm. So, but for another thing, so, uh, but for, for the, the riser base with for, honeycomb, for the riser base with the honeycomb, actually it's still under manufacture. And uh, at the last, uh, at uh, uh, my last demo, I said that we will try our best. We will try our best to um, to make make it, if you we make pre order, we try our best to make you won't uh, wait less than. Uh, 30 days. So for air assist, yes, it's uh, it's it uh, we, you will receive it just uh, several days later. But for this riser uh, base, for riser base, because we need more time and uh, yeah, and during this time there are a uh, long fa uh, long holiday in China mm -hmm. uh, as it, uh, national holiday. Yeah. yeah so we will, that will be a se seven days off. So um, we need uh, more time to ship it. And uh, in order to make up of uh, that, we make the ra we make the razor with the, together with the honeycomb. The price very low in the uh, during the live stream. So for the for the air assist, you will get the price. I think is one thirty nine one thirty nine price. And for the very big box of this one, very big and heavy box of the razor together with the honeycomb. honeycomb we have 90, we have 90 US dollars off. So the price, actually, the price is the same. So this one, this one and is this? 139, and this one is also 139. 139. Because, so compare with this one, the price of the, of the razor Recipes. together with the Hanukkah actually is a very, very good price. Uh -huh. Why the price is so good is just because we need a long time to ship yeah, it. Yeah, so, so um, okay. Uh, so that's, uh, yeah, if you, don't want, if you don't want to wait that long, yeah, you, you can wait like one month or two months later if we have all the things in our uh, warehouse. But if you think the price right now is very good, you can, uh, you can order today. I mean, for the, 
for the honeycomb and uh, uh, riser kit. But for L6 kit, you can buy it today, and you will receive it se several days later. So kid a chance to get the link. Yeah, we are we are sorry uh, for for you to make it make you wait a long time for the for the uh, honeycomb and the uh, raise base. Yeah, so please keep the chance to have the ninety dollar off riser base with honeycomb and the thirty dollar. Yeah, remember off you need to wait. Essays. You need to wait a little more long compared with the razor. We have a. And uh, we have a last project to showcase. We, if you have, a, if you have, um, actually, you, you don't need to take it out. Now we would like to engrave the wood cakes. Remove the shielding plate. Okay. If you if you have a razor, it's very easy for you to fit the different height of the of the material, signature of the material. For example, if you want to engrave on a very thick box here. Yeah. You just need to put it. Right now for so a taller sure, item. Yeah, make sure the, the surface, the upper surface of the material is uh, uh, higher than the bottom plate. Yeah, higher than the M1 bottom plate. Make it a little bit higher and they can engrave perfectly. About about taller item engraving, so you can put the or you can put the original bottom plate on the last layer, and for the honeycomb, it should be on the gamma layer, so that you have enough space to hold the taller item. Okay, that's it. And um, insert back the sheeting plates. Okay, okay, so we use the auto measure. So for X2 M1, it's very easy to use because we have a camera for you to measure the distance, measure the thickness of the material. And with the camera, you can put the uh, image that you want to engrave on the right place uh, you want. Yeah, it's done. Okay, so we set. All the things we put the X tool here. We engrave X tool on the box. Okay. At the same time, we did so many wood projects. So I just show you. Ting, please close up. I just show you this maple leaf round plane. I feel like it's something from Sailor Moon. Also, we cut a cute rabbit. Yes. It's a very beautiful and, very and clean, original. Very clean cut with the L assist. Okay, so here we uh, we finish the X tool. You can show. Uh, you can show here. Please check the engraving of a wood case. We just engraved exterior on it. So with the help of riser base and honeycomb, the focus was just right, and the line is super smooth. If you like it, you can get the riser base with honeycomb, which is saving you ninety dollars off right now. Then we come to the last project. As we all know, team close up, keep close up, please. As we all know, M1 is very versatile. It has a laser head and a blade head. So right now, I'm going to make a beautiful acrylic mirror, accessorized oh, with plate, vinyl. So for blade cutting, the bottom plate should be put back into M1.
as we don't use the honeycomb, it still stains on the last layer. Okay, that's it. And I use a catching map to catch all different colors of vinyl and put it into the M1. Make it as close to the smart camera as you can. Flat it, and that's all. To see, please change into the software screen. You can see the building smart camera auto scans the four colors of vinyl. So I'm gonna. So right now I'm gonna cut a flower on each vinyl. Really smart and easy to use. If you are new here. So you can learn it in 10 minutes and skip out your first project. So select the whole four flowers. Okay, the blank, set it to the blank card. And here I make it self-adhesive vinyl. As you choose the material, it shows you the best cutting parameters. So all of these are auto set. You don't have to like worry about the pressure, the speed, or something. Okay, so I will install the blade. So in order to in order to uh, install the blade, you'd better to take the uh, mount, take the air assist, take it out. So it's a, a magnet. So it's relatively easy to take it out. Yep, for M1 Deluxe bundle with R2 okay. Pro it's with uh, an ASC set. A more space on the on the height. And with Those the riser base with honeycomb, you can get the link through the comment. In total, you can save two hundred and thirty dollars off. Okay, the space on the bottom actually is the word very, not very enough. I will take the bottom plate out. First, and, and that way it will be easier. Okay, so if you take it out, you can uh, make the nozzle here. You can so we have a we have a clap. yeah organizer to make it organizer like this way. And then you put your blade here. So one benefit of the of using the razor is that you have uh, much space to uh, uh, operate on the on the laser head. Okay, okay. that's it. And we take the. Take the bottom plate back. For the mirror, I'm gonna engrave. It looks like this. We cut the mirror acrylic. It is on sale on extra selected. So please have the acrylic link in the comment. We accessorize it with colorful vinyls. Okay, mm -hmm. so we can start the, the machine. Everything is ready. Just I think it's start. ready. Let's start it. So with the, with the razor, it, um, uh, you can put always put the razor on, the, on your machine. It will not affect the function of the of the machine, no matter it's uh, uh, you are using laser or blade. So we also made a bunch of projects with M1. For this, we cut the gold vinyl and stuck it 
on the wine glass. It looks beautiful. Just chill, like feel the vibe of four. Also, we make a cushion accessorized with vinyl too. Fourth with four, so don't hesitate to go hiking, go camping this weekend. Let's enjoy the chill, enjoy the vibe. And for the M1 Deluxe Bundle, you can get it through the link. It is enjoying 230% off right now. Yeah, so if you, I think if you, you buy a M1, M1 RA2 Bundle, together with the accessories that we released today, you will receive $230 today for the live stream special price. So if you like the M1 machine, uh, I think it's um, uh, with the accessories that we launched today, the, the machine will be uh, more useful and uh, better today. Okay, then I'm going to engrave the acrylic mirror. Uh, for this part, I need some triangular prisons. Put them into M1. It levels up the engraving bed a little bit. For the, for the mirror, I'd like to cut, I'd like to engrave the line right here, so engrave on the back. Okay, that's done. Okay. Then we change the camera to this. The and pattern uh, should be mirror. Now it's laser flat, right? Auto capture the mirror inside. Here for the high rise, please do choose triangular pricing because I just use them. And the thickness, I guess, is around two millimeter. Engraved model, all of these are auto set, and we can process it right now. Start. Um, to ensure the process and the result is perfect, I just double check the position of this pattern. I guess that's all right. So just make it. Okay, so during, so it's the last project that we show today uh, uh, because um, we, we, have, we have some uh, users that already test our accessories uh, before we launch. Yeah, so we see the Real users, what they say, they think about the air assist kit. Okay, so we show the uh, video, our users' real video. Hi, I'm Betsy. I will tell you a little bit about my experience with the X2 M1 air assist. When I was saying okay, the was a little concerned, one, on the installation of the machine, and two, what was going to be the difference on my projects. Let me tell you a little bit more. When I started selling the air assist, it was so easy. And the part that I like the most is that the nozzle is magnetic. When you install the magnetic part on the air assist, the nozzle is gonna click in and out so fast. And here is a view of the air assist. The difference it makes when you cut your project let me show you. Here's a view of the X2 creator space. Insert your materials and the machine and upload your image. If your machine is closed, you're gonna choose laser flat. If you're using a honeycomb with the open bottom of the machine, you need to select the option of open plane. But well, right now, my machine's bottom is closed and I'm using the triangular presence. After I choose my settings, I always auto measure again. 
Finally, make sure your material settings, especially if you're scoring, engraving, or cutting. In my case, my design is the color purple because it's gonna be cut. Make sure that your settings are correct for the type of material you're cutting. And when you're ready to cut, just turn your air assist on. With this project, I cut the same image with and without the air assist to make sure to show you the difference. Oh, all the pieces just fell from the top part. This was without the air assist. And this was cut using the air assist. Look at the front and look at the back. This side cut, but not evenly. And it's the same material and same image. You see the difference? Have fun. And you need an air assist if you want a better performance of your x M1. Thank you for watching. Hey guys, Michael here. I'm actually one of the testers of M1's air assist. I have it actually running right now. I'm going to show you what this project looks like when it finished. But as far as assembling it, it's not that hard to do. Just follow the instructions and take your time. So the basics are you want to flip over your M1. You're going to remove a couple of parts from the old laser head. Once you do that, this is the hardest part is actually screwing back on this piece. Just take your time and don't cross the threads. Once you finish all that, just route the airline as you see in the instructions out the bottom, off to the side, and plug it into your M1 air pump. So it looks like this project's almost done. Let's take a look at it so you can see the benefit of the air assist for the M1. All right guys, so I have my project all finished up. This is three layers of three millimeter basswood off of Xtool's website. Let me give you a zoomed in shot so you can see just the quality behind this. As you can see, there's really intricate cuts in there, all done with no charring at all. So let me show you one more example. This is a example of cutting without the air assist. As you can see, there's a lot of charring and a lot of cleanup needed on this piece of wood here. Take a look at this one. This is with the air assist turned on much cleaner, a lot less charring on the sides. So would I recommend getting an air assist for your M1? Absolutely. The cleaner cuts, less charring, and just the overall better experience of using the M1 is definitely worth it. Appreciate you guys watching. I'll see you next time. Okay. Okay, thanks to uh, Bensi and uh, Michael to test the uh, air assist set for us. Mm -hmm. Yeah. and. Uh, yeah, uh, in the, the video, project? yeah, in the video, you just said Bazzi didn't cut through the three millimeter wood at the first time without it. She said that is because the speed she used is too high, is too fast, up to sixteen millimeter per second. Actually, if, if you want to cut three millimeter wood without, even though without it, says you can still do it. Um, but the perfect speed should be around 3 mm per second. And so thank you, Bats. And, and thank you, Michael. Thank you, Michael. Thank you all to like testing all of these items. Okay, so uh, I think we have one round of lucky draw. Mm -hmm. and, uh, um, so we have the last round of lucky draw. Uh, so Before first, that, I'd, I'd yeah. like to show you the acrylic mirror I just did. So here is the engraving line. Every flower blows, blooms in its own time. The line is quite clear. And also for the vinyl I cut, I just stuck them here. So. These are very simple pattern. If you want to like cut really complicated patterns, you can use a tool kit for weeding. There is a weeder for removing excessive waste and a spatula to leave 
images. Also, you can use a scissor inside to cut. You can get a link in the comment. Okay. Okay. Okay, we have two things to do. So first is that the M1 group giveaway, giveaway after M1, uh, a, free, a free M1 uh, L assist set. So two winners. The name of the two winners is... Uh, so congratulations, Brian Gatsby and, and uh, John, John Franhat. Yeah, you will win the uh, one uh, free M1 L assist set. And we have a lucky draw. Final yeah. round of lucky draw. The last What's round that? of Lucky Jaw. So please type M1. Please type M1. Only once. Type it only once. What, what is the Lucky Jaw? We, we'd we like to draw a winner to get a free acid set and the riser base with honeycomb panel. So together. So that's two. Yeah, that's two. all the things you that are released two today. Accessories. Yeah. So we have. How, how many winners we have? One. Okay. So who will be the winner to get the, uh, all the new things that uh, we released today? Susan? Yeah. So I guess it's yeah, the time. M1. Uh, so please, three. three, two, one, go. Okay, who is the winner? Congratulations, Kreya Skimit. Congratulations, sorry if I didn't name your name right. Congratulations, you just got two things, two new accessories. An ASC set and, and the, the riser base riser with base. honeycomb panel. Yes. So that's all for today's uh, for today's project. Till now, um, I saw someone uh, asking any discounts for i2 Pro. Yes, we offer you a direct discount so you can Click the link to get all of the accessories and M1. So Heidi, please, all the links are put down. For the AC set, you can save thirty dollars only on live. For the honeycomb panel with the riser base, you can save up to ninety dollars right now only on live. We'd like to end this live very soon, so please catch your time. And if you are new coming, you can try the M1 Deluxe Bundle with ASC set, with riser base and honeycomb. All of them come together, saving you $230 right now. Yes, and um, hope you like uh, today's uh, new uh, accessories. And uh, why you choose X2, I, I think a very, a very good reason is that we are keeping uh, to uh, improve our product through accessories, through software. So uh, the M1 machine, I think, will be the, the function will be more and more strong. And uh, not only on the hardware side, but also on the software side, the XCS software also is, uh, I think, iterating very quickly to make it uh, uh, make our user experience uh, better. Yeah. yeah. Thank you. Thank you for joining our live stream yeah, today. Yeah, so we also have a new update for X2 Creative Space, the software. We'd like to launch a beta by the end of this month. So at that time, you can do the blank calibration on Mac laptop. Um, so at this time, please, please, please catch the chance to enjoy the live only discount. So I'd like to have a few Q&A. For the pump, actually it's compatible with whatever D1 or M1, but the nozzle doesn't. M1's no nozzle is only for M1, and D1's nozzle only for D1. Yes. And uh, we, uh, we repeat the M1 group giveaway winner so the name is Brian Gatterby and uh, John Franhat. So congratulations. Okay. So um, I think we finished all the... Uh, that's all for today. That's like... all for today. Thank you for supporting us. Thank you. See you next time. See you next time. Bye-bye.